It is. Thankfully, right now we're seeing mainly just wet roads across the region. We have had some winter weather and it's still continuing across parts of southern Illinois and parts of southeast Missouri as well. Further to the south, mainly just plain old rain. Now to our west and to our north and west, they are expecting just a bit more in the way of accumulation, talking about maybe up to two inches of snow out across parts of central Missouri. That's why they've got the winter weather advisories there. Now that has not been extended eastward, though it does now include parts of the St. Louis metro area. So just use some caution as you head out the door this morning. Winter mix is likely going to stick around through much of the day today. Minimal impacts though here in our region, especially on some of the roads and heading into Thursday. All the winter weather comes to an end, though we're back to the gray skies and by Friday actually starting to warm back up. Chance for a couple showers into parts of western Kentucky. So there it is right now. Temperatures have been slowly starting to climb much of southern Illinois right now running anywhere from about uh, 30 to 32 degrees. And you can see the pink color there mixing in right across Route 13 further to the south where you've got temperatures anywhere from about 33 to 34 from Cape over near Paducah or uh, mostly just rain right now while further to the north say in places like Mount Vernon we have seen mostly snow though we're starting to also see some sleet and freezing rain mix in there as well so everything lifting up from the south to the north so that's one indication where we've got some warmer air trying to work back in again further to the south even a couple heavier pockets of rain and we could see some ice pellets or some sleet mixing in through Stoddard County right now as this lifts off to the north and east just pass through Dexter. We'll be heading towards Sykeston here in just a bit and then over towards Cairo and Cape Toronto and over the next hour or so. So again, we'll keep an eye on roads through the morning hours, but at this point expecting minimal impacts in our region. A live view from Sparta looking back towards the north and along the camera here you can actually see some of the sleet, maybe some snow mixing in. It actually looks like we've got a light glazing on some of the grassy surfaces. Road temperatures. Now when we focus on pavement temperatures here, we're talking about untreated surfaces and they're hovering right about 30 32 to 33 degrees. So it is possible still on a bridge or an overpass or a sidewalk. We could see a couple isolated slick spots, but the storm system generating this actually to our south. Lots of moisture getting pulled out of the Gulf of Mexico and a lot of rain stacked up through Arkansas back into southern Mississippi and notice the snow extends through the St. Louis metro area and all the way back up into Iowa, though not a big winter weather maker for much of our region. Now through the morning hours, we will likely see this winter mix linger around by lunchtime temperatures into the low to mid 30s and in this afternoon another batch of moisture expected to move through a mixture of some rain possibly also mixed with some light snow by about four or five o'clock this afternoon before everything finally starts to wrap up by 9 p.m. everything coming to an end in our region. So to our west and to our north and west up to about an inch on the grassy surfaces here in our area. It's likely going to be a half an inch or less. Just not a big winter storm for us again. 34 by lunchtime 37 on average for an afternoon high temperature and in this evening everything starting to wrap up after 9 p.m. by midnight we're cloudy and temperatures once again dropping below freezing. We're going to go through a major pattern change though here as we head into the weekend Sunday afternoon. So whatever does fall today is not going to be around for very long by Sunday afternoon. Check out some of these temperatures upper 50s in southern Illinois, possibly some lower 60s. So if you're one that's already sick of some of the cold weather, well, we've got some good news on the way as we head into the weekend. 37 today, 39 on Thursday, 46 in here on Friday, starting to warm back up towards the end of the week. Saturday, mostly cloudy skies, upper 40 Sunday. Sunday is probably going to be the pick day of the weekend. Their upper 50s could see some low 60s. Sunshine will return and that's his Groundhog Day as well and windy conditions for Monday and Tuesday tracking a couple different storm systems early next week looking to look uh, at this point looking more and more likely that we are going to see some rain with that Monday, Tuesday, mild days, but a sharp cool down expected for the middle of next week. Every time I hear Groundhog Day, I cannot help but think of the movie and I'm glad <laughs> we're not experiencing weather like that. Yeah, you know the stuff that we're dealing with here this morning again, it is kind of a minimal impact, just yeah. nuisance weather. Once it moves out this evening, it is warming through the rest of this week. Well,